dau wa sekta ya utalii humu nchini sasa wameelezea wasi wasi wao kuhusu kileo walichokitaja kama kucheleweshwa kwa mradi wa shilingi bilioni nne pesa za chuo cha utalii cha Ronald Ngala katika kaunti ya Kilifi. Wadau hao wanadai kuwa mradi huo sasa huenda ukagharimu zaidi ya shilingi bilioni kumi kutokana na kucheleweshwa kwa ujenzi wake kama anavyoarifu Zomolo Wanje. Ni mradi wa mabilioni ya pesa wa chuo cha utalii hapa katika ukanda pani na ambao umekwama kwa zaidi ya miaka kumi sasa wadau wa sekta utalii katika eneo hili sasa wakitaka serikali kuhakikisha kwamba wanaufadhili kwa haraka mradi huu ili utamatike kwa wakati unaofaa There are several issues that arose and uh, some of them concerns the funding so that we can be able to meet the deadline that we are struggling with to complete uh, part of the college so that it can start operating and serving Kenyans by the month of August of this year. The reports that we've gotten from Tourism Fund who are actually uh, administering and uh, 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 meeting the contractual obligations of this project uh, that funds have actually not been coming as, uh, as, uh, as scheduled. And that is a big concern also we're having because then it appears we're losing so much public money and that is the public is going to lose a lot of money out of the delays that have been accautioned uh, by the by the uh, uh, whoever has uh, not been able to list the funds uh, towards the project on time so that is our appeal whoever is in treasury whoever is uh, 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 in tpf uh, who is uh, the custodian of these funds please let's have these funds list so that uh, we can facilitate uh, the completion of this project awali mradi huu litarajiwa kugarimu serikali jumla shilingi bilion 4 lakini sasa huenda pesa hizo zikapanda hata zaidi na kufikia hadi bilioni 11 Initially the college was to cost about 4.9 billion and that was way back in 2013 uh, definitely a lot of things have happened and um and costs have I been mean, in terms of materials and everything things have gone up uh, and a good example is aluminum has gone up by 300% cement has gone up by 100% so really and uh, in terms of um, even uh, Uh, other related costs i mean things have really changed uh, so far we are looking at the projects by the time we really complete it in the next one or two years it should cost us about about 10 to 11 billion kenya shillings as an industry our concern is the duration that the project has taken uh, from the time it was conceptualized and the works began up to now uh, we we see there's still a lot to be done though we have been promised that uh, by August this year the first phase of the uh, project to be launched and we can be able to f for the first time take in students so we look forward to that time uh, that we are going to have some students coming in and actually uh, gaining uh, knowledge zomolo wanjeru ninga ya citizen county ya kilifi